Hello, Patriots. I'm Cecilia. And I'm Trayvon. And this is your HHS News. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Ready? Begin. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance, allegiance to the flag of the United, United States, States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. All right, Patriots. For St. Jude's Children's Hospital, there will be a late night show with Candace Rosado, only $1 for admissions, and is sponsored by the National Honor Society. It will be held on March 18th, and show starts at 11, 7.30 in the theater. See you there. Mm, sounds pretty good. While they're doing this, mean Heritage High School Cheer Clinic, March 19th, 8 to 1 p.m., ages 5 to 6. Pizza is $20, there's a t-shirt included for $25. Um, spaces are limited, so beware of that. It's me 7 to the 18th, 3.30 to 5.30 p.m. in front of the Heritage High School cafeteria. At the cheer clinic, each group will be divided by their age. They'll be learning different cheer routines, jumps, and um, chants also. Please contact MJ Smith for more details. Okay. National Honor Society will be having an Ono Hawaiian barbecue fundraiser on March 24th from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. Support, it supports your National Honor Society. All, of, all patriots are welcome, and 50% of your thing will go to, 50% of your order will go to National Honor Society. Flyers are found in Mr. Posley's classroom. Mm, sounds good. Well, let's con congratulate our FFA at UC Davis. Second place is for the nursery landscape. Third veteran, and for the freshman, sixth place, best informed green hand, and sixth place, vegetables, and seventh place, from records, farm records, and 40th, livestock judging. FFA will have a veggie and plant sale Thursday and Friday from 315 to 515. They will be selling six pack liners for $2 each or one gallon size vegetables for $4 each or three for 10. Cash only and we do not accept the $100 bills. Mm. Sounds good. Well, there's gonna be a career fair March 22nd. Only for juniors and seniors, please dress decently. You could get hired. We wanted to congratulate FFA for their wins at Escondido. There will be fourth place, they have fourth place for best in four green hand, fifth place in livestock, second place in record book, first place in OH, first place in vegetable crops, and first place in veterinary science. Mm, sounds good. Well, there's gonna be a prom expo this March on the 18th. There will be vendors there, so better be there. <laughs> ASL will be holding a movie night on 3-18, and they will be showing No Ordinary Hero. Mm. All right, and the quote of the day is, the true science of intelligence is not knowledge, but imagination. Albert Einstein. Well, that's it, Patriots. I'm Cecilia. And I'm Trey Vaughn. And that's your HHS News. Welcome to your Heritage Student Sports. I'm Lou Lama. I'm Tyler, and to start off with, we have swim. Congratulations to Chris Perez for breaking two school records, one in the 50 free and the other in the 100 fly. He got a time of 23.74 in the 50 free, and the 100 fly, he got 59.47. Also, a congratulations to Caitlin Thomas for qualifying for CIF in their first meet in the 100 back and the 200 IM. Great job. That's great. But also for softball, we have a record of two to three. Alina Ponce de Leon is pitching very well, so keep it up all season. And all soccer players, you need to return your uniforms to La Rochelle in W205 ASAP. Also for track, we have girls 8 by 100 team taking second place, and that was led by CJ, Maramel, and Kaylee. We have James Phillips with the sixth fastest 200 time in CIF Southern Section Division One in the state. We also have the Wildcat Relay Girls Discus taking first and second in shot put, and that was led by Kayla Gower. We also have boys shot put taking second, and that was led by Hunter Gurton. Boys 8x200 Relay took first place, and the fastest time was by Alex Tello. We have girls 4x12 taking third with an amazing, amazing finish by Susan Peralta. And we're going to go over to volleyball. They're off to a great start this season. Keep it up. Show up to their games at 445 after school. Make sure you come and support them through their good season. 
Don't forget to support tennis with a record of 5-1. to one. They're ranked number 5 in all of the Inland Empire and the only one in the R division ranked with upper divisions. We have beaten teams that have never been beaten in the school's history and the season's just started. Looking to go back to the CIF finals for the second year in a row with the coolest coach, Doug Fairchild. The team's quote is, this year's for Fairchild. Let's do it big. That's great. <laughs> um, in baseball, in their last game, they won 4-0. to zero. Kyle Toll pitched a shutout, which is amazing in any level of baseball. Congratulations to Kyle Toll. That's amazing. Go out support your baseball team. They're a lot better than we expected. Yeah. Go out support. We also have our softball team, 3-4. to four. They beat Talkwitz with 15-11, to 11, and they beat Desert Hot Springs with 29-1. to one. <laughs> Wow. Well, that's your sports. You know, we have a lot of results, a lot of sports coming up. Make sure you support all your sports throughout the rest of their season. It can help them a lot through the long run. There's a lot of great sports going on. They're doing great things. Well, that's your sports segment. I'm Tyler Alexander Baca. And I'm Ulama Gumcharai Madarenge. Thanks for tuning in.